located in the middle of eastern Antarctica, a strange, oval-shaped structure, measuring 400 feet across may be one of the ultimate pieces of evidence that ancient civilizations once roamed Antarctica. Talk about ancient civilization inhabiting Antarctica has existed for decades. What if, in the distant past, when Earth in Antarctica, was much different than today, an ancient civilization developed there, creating fascinating structures, monuments and temples there? Would we find evidence of their existence today? Curiously, there are numerous ancient maps that depict parts of Antarctica free of ice. One of the most controversial maps was without a doubt composed in 1513, by Turkish Admiral Peri Reis, who drew a map that would create a global debate over 500 years after him. The map depicts Antarctica, which was discovered between 1818 to 1820. But how is this possible? It has become a popular belief that ancient civilizations across the globe were in fact much more advanced than what mainstream researchers are crediting them for. Numerous maps discovered in the past are clear indications that the story told today by scholars is incomplete, and there are numerous missing links in our history. These missing links are being put together by these incredible ancient maps that prove mankind inhabited our planet much longer than what mainstream scholars believe. Perhaps these ancient maps, in combination with modern satellite images of our planet are the ultimate evidence that civilization could have developed in the most inhospitable places on Earth in the distant past. According to numerous indicators, such structures have already been identified in recent years. Satellite imagery of the Antarctic continent has revealed several structures that are spread across the icy continent. While some of them can easily be explained as natural geological formations, there are some discoveries that question everything we know about Antarctica. Whether or not these structures are man-made, and are evidence of lost ancient civilizations inhabiting Antarctica is hard to tell, and unlikely according to mainstream scholars. However, there are numerous discoveries that point otherwise and suggest that we need to look at things from a different perspective. In 2012, a satellite image of Antarctica spotted a strange oval-shaped formation in one of the most remote places on the planet. Thousands of miles from society, the strange oval-shaped structure raised numerous questions among experts. At 400 feet across, experts analyzing the image ask whether or not this structure could be the result of Mother Nature. The unusual shape of the structure suggests it may be man-made formation. Observing the image, we immediately notice how the rings of the structure resemble a structure in ruins, as if we were looking at walls that have been destroyed, collapsed ruins that have been covered by snow and ice. The image taken in 2012 clearly resembles something that may easily have been designed by someone. But designed by whom? The structure is located in the middle of Antarctica, one of the most inhospitable places on the surface of the planet one of the most remote and untouched places on Earth, Eastern Antarctica. While the structure may be a man-made structure, experts have to consider a natural explanation. A bizarre ice formation created heavy snowfall, low temperature, and Antarctica's freezing catabatic wind. Experts believe that what satellites spotted over Eastern Antarctica may be oddly shaped as drudgy sharp irregular grooves formed on a snow surface by wind erosion. Snow slash ice dunes. However, Sastrugi run parallel to the direction of the wind and do not tend to create nearly perfectly shaped oval structures.